Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be telling you beginners a starter kit that you can get from the drugstore. And I achieved this look what I have on my face right now with drugstore products. So if you watch this video and then the video I'm going to upload right afterwards, that'll be great because it shows you how I use those products. But in this video I'm just going to mainly just name the products and the utensils I got from the drugstore and um, how you can achieve this face. So for my eyebrows for this um, this look I use my Maybelline Define a Brow um, pencil in the color medium brown and you can find this at um, Target, Walgreens, um, CVS, Walmart and it retails for about um, $4.59 almost $5.00 and it comes in different shades as well and to fill it in with I use this brow powder from Salon Perfect and you can find that in um, Walmart that's why I got mine from for like $2.69 and this is in a dark brown as well and I set my eyebrows with my elf um, clear brow gel it's a little brown from my um, eyebrows but this is what I use to set my brows and for the brushes I use a elf flat top kabuki brush is named a elf powder brush in the stores and that retails for three dollars I also use my real technique powder brush and you can find these in Walmart now or Ulta in Target and this retails for $9.99 I also use my Real Technique Expert Face Brush to contour in the hollows of my cheek and this retails for about $6.99 I use my Real Techniques um, blush brush to put on the blush in the apples of my cheek and this retails for about $6.99 as well to put my highlight on, I use my e.l.f. Um, stippling brush, and this retails for $3. To clean up my eyebrows and to put in the shadow to fill them in, I use my small angle brush from e.l.f. This retails for $3. For my eyeshadow, I use my e.l.f. Um, shader, shadow brush for $1. And I also use my contour brush, but I use this for the um, outer V. It wasn't really working well, as you can see in the video, um, how I wanted to. But e.l.f. does have a blending brush, but I didn't have that to do my video with, so I use my Sedona Lace blending brush. But how I use this, you can use your e.l.f. blending brush. For eyeliner, I use my Jordana um, liquid eyeliner. And you can find this at Walgreens for $1.99. For my foundation, I use my CoverGirl Outlast Stay Fabulous. And this retails for about $9.99, $7.89. Sometimes it's on sale, but the most I'll pay is $9.99 for it. I know some places like Target um, has it for like $12.79 which is too much. For the eyeshadow, I use my CoverGirl Quad um, eyeshadow and I also use this color as a highlight. So just these three, I kept it neutral for the video and I know most of you beginners don't like to go all out with the color. Oh, to prime my face, I couldn't find my e.l.f. Primer, but they have an e.l.f. primer for I think three dollars to six dollars in the studio line. But uh, I just use my NYX one for the video because this is the only drugstore one I can find at the moment. For um, concealer, I use my LA Girl Pro concealer. And you can, and this retails for one ninety nine in your beauty supply store. And the primer retails for about. Um, for $79 NYX and for my mascara I use my Maybelline Colasco May, um, 
Mascaras run differently in every store, so I'll say $6.79, and most of the time Walgreens have buy one, get one 50% off. I love drugstore mascaras. I have yet to buy like a benefit, benefit one. They're real or anything for $30, $20 for some mascara. Uh, to set my concealer under my eye, I use my translucent powder from e.l.f., and this retails for $3.00. To contour, I oops, I use my CoverGirl Ebony Bronzer, and this retails for about seven dollars, five dollars. It varies in each store. For my blush, I use my Pearlescent Pink from Wet n Wild, and this retails for one ninety nine. To set my foundation, I use my L'Oreal True Match Powder. And this retails for about $4.99. Uh, I also put on my eyes my NYX Matte Shadow. This retails for about um, $2.79. On my lips, I use my Nikki K Lip Liner from the Beauty Supply Store. And that's like a dollar to $2. I use my Wet n Wild Lipstick. And this is $2 as well. And I use my Bonnabelle... Um, lip gloss and this retails for about three dollars I s used a beauty blender dupe and this retails for about five dollars you can get them different places and it's cheaper or higher and I sprayed my dupe beauty blender with Avion water or you could just put it under some water and I set my face with my NYX um, finish matte powder and that was about five dollars as well so as you can see I achieved a very flawless beautiful look with drugstore products don't make anyone believe um, that you have to use um, high-end products to get a good face yes there some are better quality but drugstore products does the trick as well and especially if you're a beginner because I started off with drugstore products as well and then as I got better in technique as you can see I don't really use this for my brows anymore but um, it definitely does eyebrows just the way I do them with my high-end eyebrow pencil and for if I wear makeup every day, I would start using this back because if I use my other ones, that means I'll have to buy it more and more and more, and that's more money. But definitely on clients, I use um, more of my high end products because it's better quality, better for picture taking, and somewhat of that sort. But all these products will be listed below, and in the next video, you will see how I applied all these things to my face to achieve this look. So thank you so much for watching. If you have any other questions or request any other videos, please just let me know, and I'll be glad to do it. Hope you guys have a great day. Bye.